Hi, my name's Cameron Carlson with Anime and Location.tv. I'm here at Animaticon 2018 with my very good friend, Miss Caroline. How are you doing? I'm doing quite well, thank you. Good, good to hear. So how did you get start performing or to perform and do stage work uh, in your career? Well, I actually have been into voiceover work for quite a while. It started when I was really young and I loved watching four kids. <laughs> and after a while, I started to be curious about what other characters certain people have voiced. And that's how I, re that's how I really g got into it. But I didn't really realize that I wanted to do it until after I was getting out of my childhood development in an education stage in college. So I'm really excited. <laughs> That's wonderful to hear. So um, what are, when you're performing on stage, what time, um, what show are you performing at this time on stage? Well, currently I am a part of a radio theater production at Milo Groban, which is, it used to be a school, but now it's a building for artists, so where, where, where they live. And currently we are working on the Wizard of Oz. Nice. Maybe you've heard of it, maybe you haven't. <laughs> but I am currently playing the lead. Okay. So you're playing Dorothy? I am. Alrighty, good. Well, I hope to hear Over the Rainbow, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> so, how long have you been performing? We have been... We have been doing this for over a year now, believe it or not. Nice. Any, like, when did you, like, start performing? Like, at a young age or more like in your teen years? Well, start performing? I really cannot say I've been in any any sort of plays or anything as a child. But I'd say that, that The Wizard of Oz is really the first actual thing with voicing that I'm a part of. Okay, so very, very new, right? Yes, it okay, is. Okay, good. We like to hear that. Good. So is there a certain anime character that you like to voice someday? Well... In terms of characters, I have really thought about that one for quite a while, but I would like to sometime voice Pokemon. Like be one of the Pokemon or be one of the humans? Either one would really work, but I am really good at, at imitating the Pokemon themselves, but I'm terrible at the young, at the young male. Alright, so none of, the, none of the male characters, huh? Well, yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Now, you've been following Anime and Location for us for a while. How do you think we're doing? Uh, I think you're, you're doing quite well. <laughs> Alrighty. Is there anything you think we could probably improve upon? Well, I think you're doing quite fine in the way you're doing things. Alright. Thank you so much for letting us know. Thank you. And is there any other guests you would like to meet and why? Well... I've already met several voice actors in the past, notably Chuck Huber twice. Yeah, he's a sweetheart. <laughs> he is. And I would really love to meet Todd Habercorn someday. Todd. I will tell you right now, Todd and I are very good friends, and so when we meet each other, we pretend to be brothers together. <laughs> oh my gosh, he seems like a lot of fun. He, he, always go, he always seems to go for the fun roles. He always gets the fun ones, and he's a lot of fun, and especially when he's Natsu. I really like him as Natsu. Oh, I, I mainly know him as, as Italy from Italia, <laughs> and I know him as Death the Kid from Soul Eater. Yep. Yep. He, I talked to him about those roles really extensively. Um, so this year for Animaticon is all about villains. What villain would you like to cosplay if you could? What, what villain? Yeah. Let's see. I suppose I'm cosplaying as one now, technically. Well, Android 18 is kind of more of an anti-hero. I really never realized that part. Well, she joins the side of good towards the towards later on, right? Well, yes. So I think I would like to try Cinderfall from Ruby. Oh, Cinder's a fun one. I like Cinder. She's got a lot of character to her. Right. She does. <laughs> Is there any message you want to get to the fans that have come out to support you at your productions? <laughs> have fun and just go for it. All right. Thank you, Caroline, so much for coming and talking with us. Thank you. Thank you very much for having me.